Because of the wide use of cyberspace and our dependence on it, we have an inherent vulnerability. And that's why it's vital that we defend it properly. Generally, in warfare, you have an organized enemy, uh, a force that's mobilized by a country, has a nation's backing. Uh, the cyberspace attacks can occur on an individual basis. Anybody with a $200 laptop and the right skill sets can go in and wreak havoc in cyberspace. Some examples of where you would find cyberspace are the control of uh, power systems. Uh, nuclear power is regulated uh, through the use of computers. Your water systems regulated through computer systems. Because we operate so much in cyberspace, that is the new battlefield. Uh, it's constantly changing and therefore we need to be able to adapt and overcome the problems that we face in cyberspace. And the Air Force is there to answer that call. In the future, this is going to be the premier warfighting domain. Um, this is going to be where the major battles occur. I'm Captain Scott Hink and I'm an Air Force Cyber Warrior.